I do feel like I kind of want an Elise, though. I have, like, never drawn a two-drop Death Rattle minion, and I have so many. I do think every deck needs an Elise. Elise makes every deck better. See you, Stukes. Enjoy. Um, I actually wanted Mass to spell. None of these are good. Yeah, I'm just going to take this. I assume he's Death Rattle Hunter, most likely. Oh, okay. Yeah, Death Rattle Rogue is a deck that I'm uh, interested in trying. Oh, this deck should probably have a Karen. People always just want to kill a Devil Strike nowadays. They just gotta get rid of it. I didn't have anything to do with that, so I appreciate it. Ah, bomb, okay. Kinda want that Master Spell still. Um, kinda tempted to just cube this. Like, attack here. So, I mean... Now this will kill my cube and give me two more five fives. Cube stone, cubes of cube craft. All right. All right. Well, it's going off, but I mean, it certainly could be a lot worse for me, right? So if I Visions and I get Twilight's Call, we get an egg and a cube, which kind of stinks. But we get the egg, and we're progressing our quest. Well, now we didn't get either of those. I'm going to take a... I'm going to take a... Eh, maybe I'll just take Visions again. Because <laughs> I, I may just want to like scream him, scream him multiple times at this point. So yeah. As soon as I am using this, I don't have it for... Okay. For the lash, but this obviously changes things quite a bit. The Rexar makes it so that I can't just sit back and play a you know purely reactive type of game. I can't just Duskbreaker that. Amalgam. Um, I, mean, I could, like, Duskbreaker Death Fist. That's kind of bad. So, Twilight's Call. Right now, eh, we'll Twilight's Call. Eh, okay. A bad one and a good one. Why Zola not in the deck? Uh, I, I cut it from this version because I wanted to try being more proactive with eggs and such. It's possible it should be in it. This is like a very early sketch. I'm in like, you know, game four or something that I played with the deck, so. This is game five. I'm two and two so far. Um, I'm just gonna do this. Uh oh, that's not good. Okay. Well. It's not actually that big a deal, because it's not like it's not like he's like, you know, smushing my face with that. He's like nothing on the board right now. This is the scary thing, just the fact that he's just, you know, has the Rexar hero power.
I'm just gonna Alex him. I really need to find, like, Anduin or... Okay. Well, that's all you got. That's all you got, Rush, so, haha. -ha. Spend your entire turn doing that. That's fine. Another candle shot. Okay. My face. Okay, there's Cube. Hmm. If I, like, can stick something and get, like, a good cube off, but obviously I need to, like, deal with Shaw first. Okay. It's not doing anything yet. Okay. Well, Psychic like Scream time, then. So we've, we've dealt with a cube. Ooh, and it's Dormu. I'm just Psychic like Scream into Nightmare Amalgam. And then... We have, I mean, I'm probably just going to play the Amara for, like, Tempo soon. I don't really have, I mean, I need to find, like, Anduin or something, too. Like, it's just ho so hard to keep up with Rexar. Yep. Sure. What kind of visions for at this point? A Psychic Scream, a Mask Dispel, that's it. You guys ready? Go, 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 go. Ah, he answered it. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Well, I'm definitely gonna visions. Well, no, I can visions and get. I'm guaranteed scream from visions anyway, huh? We can Amara here. Like, if I draw Experimenter, I can play Experimenter, Twilight's Call, and then Carnivorous Cube when I get off the Twilight's Call, and immediately get, like, back, you know, two bigger things. So, yeah, I just wanna play Amara into Double Loot Hoarder, I think. Because I can also potentially, like, Mirage Call or a Cube, which is obviously really powerful, too. Oh dear, okay. That's not good for me. Well, there's Anduin. There's Experimenter. There's Scream. Oh, those both suck! I can't Experimenter on, like, either of them with Cube. Neither, neither of them are good to get with Cube. I literally have, like, one Dead Ringer to get back. Ugh, that's so bad. This deck definitely wants Karn. Karen. Karen. God, that's just such a such a disaster. I wonder if I even want Twilight's Call in this deck at this point. I don't even know. We're just dead. I also like because I, you know, didn't visions, now I don't have like another really good thing to visions. I just have a mass to spell. I'm just gonna get fatigued anyway. <sighs> okay, so this one deck wants a Karn. Maybe I do just take out the shadow visions. Cause like Twilight's Call getting back. The Twilight's Call is like what, half of what makes Awaken the Makers work. So now I can play Reckless Experimenter, Carnivorous Cube, Mirage Color the Cube, so he doesn't kill this. So that's still pretty powerful. Oh. 
Shaw. Okay. So, I can like attack these. I can attack at this into this. Play Andwin ping this. I can't actually dusk... I have a Primordial Drake and a Mirage Collar left. I have nothing to get with Shadow Visions at the moment. I uh, screamed the Shaw. That's how it, he had it again. I mean, I have both Duskbreaker and Mossy that can pop my eggs, depending. Well, I can only Mossy this turn. Now I have four five fives in play. And my opponent is seated! Here I am just like trying to figure out like, okay, how can I possibly win? Like, he has Rexar. At least try and get a life stealer or something. I mean I'll take it. I'll take it, but <laughs> what happened there?